Star's bid was a winning one after they managed to outbid the likes of Sony Pictures, Network, India and of Reliance, the other two bidders. After the Board of Cricket Control for India did their checks on the feasibility, the three-hour auction on Thursday gave the bidders 30 minutes to contest the bid. Star's bid was an increase of 59% from the previous cycle of Indian cricket rights, which were sold for US$750 million US dollars at that time for the period 2012 through 2018. In addition to its Indian presence, Star also has a strong grip internationally, having paid US$1.9 billion US for the broadcasting rights for the ICC tournaments from 2015 throughout 2023. They now hold the two most valuable broadcast rights in cricket, having bought the IPL rights for US$2.55 billion US dollars back in September 2017 for the period 2018 throughout 2022. The average cost per match for the Indian cricket rights sold on Thursday was about US$9 million, which is higher than the average cost per IPL game for the 2018 through 2022 periods, which is roughly US$8.4 million. Star's whopping $944 million deal will now see them telecast 102 men's international matches over the next five-year period, compared to 96 in the previous six-year cycle from 2012 to 2018. With matches being split across the home season as follows, 18 matches set for the 2018 through 2019 period, 26 set for 2019 through the year 2020 period, 14 matches set for 20 to 21, 23 from the years 21 to 22 and 21 matches when their contract expires from the year 2022 to 23.